Uh, well, a person's true passion has a funny way of tracking them down. In this morning's Zebley Zone, Jeff meets a San Diegan who always felt like a fish out of water. Today we're visiting a home in La Jolla where the walls are lined with the catch of the day. When I was a kid, I always liked working on cars, bicycles, anything with wheels on it. Rocky Frost is your typical San Diegan, raised in Pacific Beach, then off to STSU. Got my music degree in accordion performance. But his life took a hard right turn when his father asked him, Hey, you want to start an auto body restoration shop? For 47 years. That's a 1970 Pontiac GTO. Rocky managed custom auto body in Kearney Mesa. And I knew that was going to be the rest of my life. Was your heart in it at the shop? <sighs> That's a great question. Um, my dad knows that I probably wasn't, but he knew it was good for me, and he was right. Rocky always loved painting, just not cars. Three years ago, I, my wife Carolyn and I retired, and uh, now I'm an artist. <laughs> Rocky is a kayak fisherman who started using the fish he caught to put his own special spin on a Japanese art style called Gayo Taku. You catch a fish. Yes. You paint the fish. Yes. And then you put the paper on the fish. You put it on top and pull it off and it transfers the image. This is what it looks like when I pull it off. You can smell the fish on these pieces of paper. <laughs> it was on a kayak a few years ago. Rocky made our news. Yes, I hooked a nine-foot hammerhead shark off La Jolla Shores. And when I came in, I saw the Channel 8 news crews there. I knew Kelly Hesedal. I've seen her before. Fisherman Rocky Frost says he's encountered hammerhead sharks several times in the past month. Rocky didn't bring the hammerhead home, but rockfish are a different story. When you reel one up, you never know what you're going to get. I think it's important to add that you've got a lifetime of art on your walls. Right. That's more traditional. It is. But it's the Gayo Taku that's so unique. Rocky, at the age of 67, just reeled in his first art exhibit. The name of my show is Something's Fishy and for the birds. Just like the cars he worked on for nearly five decades, Rocky's restoring himself with art. It's going to, I think. <laughs> we'll find out. In the Zevely Zone. Never give up because you never know what's going to happen. Jeff Zevely, CBS 8.